Hi everyone, I am Sydney with Chic Stripes. I just wanted to start out by saying thank you guys so, 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 so much for all of your comments and tweets and support on my blog post on Monday, which announced my video segment. It is going to be aired tomorrow at 5 p.m. on NBC12 if you are local to Richmond, and I'm kind of nervous about how it's going to turn out. I feel like I'm going to look silly or say something dumb, and it's going to be the thing that's put on TV. So I guess we'll see. Um, it should be really fun, though. I was really excited to be able to film it um, and work with Jen and to be able to spotlight two um, of my favorite locally owned uh, consignment stores. So please check it out. I'll definitely be posting the link on my blog and social media channels if you can't watch it live. So yeah, so that's it. So I wanted to come and bring to you a short haul. I haven't done a haul video in a while. It's been about a month, um, but that doesn't mean I haven't been shopping. I actually am trying to stop shopping because I have some things I'm saving up for um, that I need to actually pay for instead of buying clothes. But I did have a few things here and there that I have gotten that I wanted to share. So first thing I have, oh, first, first thing is this French Connection dress. I got this at Baggio Consignment. It was originally marked $60 and I actually got it for about $20 because it was marked 70% off. And I actually tried to give this to a girl to try on who was looking for a homecoming dress and it would have been perfect. For whatever reason, she didn't want it. So I said it was coming home with me. I tried it on and I loved it. Here it is. If you can see, um, it's, it's not really sheer, but semi sheer panel at the top, um, a t buckle at the waist or tie at the waist. and this kind of loose fabric, and then it has kind of a spandexy tight skirt fabric. Um, it looks really cute on. I'm hoping to wear it to some Christmas parties, and I'm just really excited about it. I do need to take it to a tailor. Um, the sleeves here need to be taken up a bit in the shoulders because it is it just falls a little bit too low for me. But so I paid twenty dollars for a French Connection dress. It had has the tag so on it um, from wherever it was being sold originally, some boutique somewhere. So. Really excited about that right now. It's in my to be tailored pile. So the next thing I got um, again was from Baggio, and this was a complete splurge purchase. It was one of the things that I saw it and I said I have to have it. And I didn't really need it because I spent ninety dollars on it. Um, but it's this really super cool, and I love it every time I look at it. Um, fur cape thing. I'm gonna put it back on the hanger so you can see what it looks like. Um, I've worn this out twice, and I actually really love it. So here you go. Looks better on the hanger. You can tell what it is. Um, but it's like a little cape jacket. Um, little hoodie type thing. And it's actually knit with some fur knit into it to give it really great texture and details. Here's the sleeve on that end. Um, no, 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 I just really like it. It's a good piece. Um, I'm glad I have it. Do I need it? No. So this kind of fueled my need to stop shopping trips. Um, so the next thing I did get, um, and you've seen it in a lot of blog posts, um, is this ring. If you can see it kind of up close. It is a sterling silver ring. Um, it is engraved, I think it says Mexico, and in 926, which is the symbol for sterling silver. From The Nest, um, it's a cute little antique store. I got this for $30, and I love it. I've literally worn it every day since I've gotten it. Um, it's just a great, simple, solid, but kind of designed piece that goes with everything. So wear this nonstop. We're really glad I purchased this. Um, I feel like there was something else. So most recently, these two random purchases, again, I don't really need them, but I got these gold stud earrings. I don't know where they're from. Um, they're from Clothes Mentor. I really like them. I'm glad I bought them. My friend Lisa talked me into them. They're $4. So they were cheap. They don't really hurt my ears, actually. Um, I wore them in a blog post recently, too. Um, but yeah, cute, fun. Not necessary, though. Um... Okay, really not necessary, but one of my latest addictions is a sugar skull. If you don't know what a sugar skull is, you need to get educated because they're really cute. So I got this necklace, um, again at the Clothes Mentor event. It's a sugar skull necklace. It's by Betsy Johnson, who's totally not really my designer. Um, not really a fan of her pieces, but this is just really cute. Um, I tried to talk myself out of it because I don't wear stuff like this. Then I ended up creating a whole outfit that looked really cute with it. And for whatever reason, I'm just, I think it's so cute. Um, so we'll see how much I wear it, but oh, I paid $13 for this. I don't know what, what it would have sold for. She's so cute. It's little hearts for the eyes. So, and last but not least, um, I got this polo crossbody 
leather bag. Um, I got this at the thrift store the other day. They were having a 50% off sale at one of the thrift stores I go to. So I got this bag for 60 cents. Um, I really couldn't say no, and it's super cute. Although I asked my husband what he thought of it, and he told me it was really ugly. So he didn't like the plaid, that it was pretentious. Which I guess I could see, but I think it's cute. Um, styled right, it could look non-pretentious. Um, but it's super long crossbody, has a little tag that has the horse on it that you can see. Um, so it's polo on this side. I did take it to Baggio and clean it up a little bit with some leather cleaner, so it looks a lot nicer. It's very small. Um, you can see on the inside it has kind of two pockets. But I thought it was a great, great bag just to hold phone, keys, and my driver's license if I wanted a really small crossbody. And I don't have one in a green, blue plaid yet, so for 60 cents I figured I could swing this. So anyway, that's it. Um, just some little things. I feel like I've forgotten something, but I can't for the life of me think of what it is. Oh, duh. So I knew I bought something. Um, okay, so also from Baggio, um, I bought a while ago a pair of Citizens of Humanities blue skinny pants. Um, Citizens of Humanity, if you guys know denim, then you're a fan. This is a medium rise 29 inch skinny. Size 26. Citizens of Humanity. Here we go. Blue denim. Um, I'm not a fan of colored denim. I have a pair of green in my H jeans um, that I won in a blog giveaway, and I really don't wear them just because I don't do printed colored denim. Um, but this navy I treat almost as black or a jean. Um, and it just gives a little bit of polish, a little bit of edge to outfits that you don't really want to wear jeans to because it's too dressed, too dressed down, but the navy pant is perfect. Um, so I actually wear these a lot, and I got these for $20. Um, they were originally at least triple that price, probably 60 or $80. And I don't know how I never saw them when I was there, just browsing through the racks, but it just seemed like one day I pulled them out and they were there for $20. And I put them on and they fit me perfectly. I absolutely love them. So $20, Citizen of Community Jeans. Can't beat that. Um, yeah, so that's it. That's my hauls. Um, sorry if these pants are dirty. I just washed them. I had to grab them from the laundry. We have lint on them. But that's my hauls. Not a whole lot of stuff, just some little things here and there. Hopefully I am done for a little while. I am saving up for a new camera, an iPod, an iMac, um, and some other things that are coming down the pike. So hopefully you'll find about those soon. But I need some cash instead of clothes. And one thing I have realized recently is I do not need any new clothes. So you heard it here first. No new clothes. So if you want to gift me, so my gift cards to the thrift store so I can buy some clothes. That'd be awesome. But anyway, that's it. Um, I will see you guys in my next haul. Um, or if you watch my video tomorrow, then I will see you there. So thanks for watching. Bye.